Her Majesty died yesterday aged 96 at what is understood to be one of her favorite British residences. Buckingham Palace said in a statement that the Queen died peacefully. A period of mourning has now been announced and the date of the Queen's state funeral will be revealed presently. Mourners have delivered flowers, photographs and touching messages to the gates of Buckingham Palace and other royal residencies. They are also able to post a message of condolence to the family online. You can do this also by visiting the royal family's official website, here. While on the web page, simply enter your name, email address, location and below this your message in the allocated boxes. After doing this, click preview below and next, send your message. A selection of the submitted message will be passed on to members of the royal family. Some may also be held in the Royal Archies for prosperity, the website notes. Read more, new official documents hints at Queen's official funeral date it is understood that there will be no physical books of condolence at royal households. A number of High Commission offices have, however, made it clear they will be opening physical documents for signing. These include the British High Commission offices in Nigeria, India and Senegal. Don't miss! Andrew looks set to take on Queen's beloved dogs after Monarch's death. Reveal! Queen's poignant last moments with Charles and Anne by her side. Insight! Inside Buckingham Palace. Glimpse inside Queen Elizabeth II's home. Analysis. In his first speech as King, Charles III expressed his thanks for those who have already sent their condolences. He said, on behalf of all my family, I can only offer the most sincere and heartfelt thanks for your condolences and support. They mean more to me than I can ever possibly express. The king added, in a little over a week's time we will come together as a nation, as a commonwealth and indeed a global community, to lay my beloved mother to rest. In our sorrow, let us remember and draw strength from the light of her example. Charles III has expressed his wish that a period of royal mourning be observed from now until seven days after the Queen's funeral. Related articles Solemn Kate pictured for first time since Queen's death comment from US professor mocking Queen's death removed by Twitter new official documents hints at Queen's official funeral date. Thank you.